What is it about dogs in Manhattan? Man, dogs in Manhattan are different than dogs other places. It's like, you know, they got all this, all this pavement, and, it's, and they don't really, it's like they don't even know what it is to be a real dog. It's kind of sad if you, if you want my opinion on it. My theory about dogs in Manhattan is that all the people in Manhattan use these dogs as like creepy, like accessories. These dogs are like bracelets and earrings. Yeah, I was in uh, I was in the village earlier today, and there was a there was a dog store where everything costs you know upward of 100 or 200 bucks per sweater for you know dogs this big. So that afternoon, Hosky and I were invited to a gallery opening in Brooklyn. For an undisclosed amount of money, our guide snuck us across the border. God spelled backwards. I don't think that's a coincidence. Why do you think there's so many dogs in New York? Because I think people in Manhattan are actually super lonely. You think you think that despite all of these people, this is like the loneliest city probably in America? Yeah, kind of. Nice. Because it's not like you see, it's not like you see, um, like regular dogs. Like you don't see like mutt dogs, and, like dirty dogs. You see this like primed, like totally pampered, like, uh, John Frise is and other dogs, they're just ridiculous and don't exist for doing anything other than just hanging out at your house and like, eating your food. You can't like wrestle a dog like that. It doesn't make any sense to me. 